Hey, what's up everyone? This is Mr. Fish from the Lands of Aiden server and I will be guiding you through the level 45 illusionist quest. Now before you begin this, it's a very good idea to go ahead and grab yourself a map all of Aiden from the NPC Melissa. Um, not only is it good for this quest, it's good for lineage in general. So. Go ahead and go to Aiden and use the scroll of escape until you see the NPC on the bottom left corner of your screen. Go ahead and buy that map and once you do that, then it's a good idea to start the quest. So let's all head on down to Silveria and talk to now, the Oldest Lane has the quite a quest for you this time. Um, he's going to give you uh, his third letter and uh, three green crystals of time. So the main thing about this quest is uh, the ant caves. The ant caves are really difficult to deal with. The ant cave that we're going to be going through is uh, ant cave number six, which is uh, located directly above the oasis. As you can see on the map, it's right uh, in the eye of oasis. And as soon as you enter, the first one is pretty easy. I'll be going through these uh, pretty quick, but I will show you the entire walkway um, in case you want to walk through this. Now, if it if this proves too difficult to you, which it was for me, then uh, you can go ahead and use uh, scrolls of teleportation to avoid the giant white ants, which you'll see in a few seconds. They can be uh, a really big handful at level 45 on your own. You're going to require a lot of potions. So here we go, we're going to go straight to uh, the second level. And uh, there we go, yeah, there's the warning. Um, definitely want a lot of uh, squirts of teleportation. The best method in these cases is to just click on the remains of white ant and just grab your item and get out of there, especially in this part. This is very, very dangerous if you're doing it alone at level 45. Okay, once you're out of there, you'll have uh, three fragments of memory, uh, three pieces of memory, rather. And you're going to want to take that right back to Elder Slain in Silveria. But uh, he is not done with you yet. He wants uh, some more memory, so you're going to have to take his fourth letter and head on down to Fire Valley. Um, his pouch contains a uh, scroll to Weldon, just in case you haven't bookmarked welding for some reason at 45, but uh, go ahead and use that and uh, go straight to Fire Valley Beach. Bookmark that if you haven't already. It's a very useful bookmark throughout the entire game. This is the easy part. 
Once you get past the ants, the rest is complete cake. I don't even think that I uh, fight anything here. As long as you're polymorphed, uh, nothing here will attack you. So, if you want to go ahead and find these on your own, then you might want to just uh, not look right now. But uh, if you just want to get this over with as fast as possible, like most people, then uh, this is a pretty good guide. Fast feet. Okay. So you use the blue crystal time that it gives you, and uh, you get another thought frag. So once you get your first one, you teleport back to Five Valley Beach, and we'll go up to the second one. So let's go. Again, the map of Aiden is a giant help throughout the game, and uh, it's an easy way to help each other locate what you're talking about. Especially when dealing with guides like this. That effort actually dropped me a Bezo. It was uh, generous. Okay, you don't need to just teleport back to Five Valley Beach after the second frag. You can actually, it's a lot easier to just walk there. It's really close by. And we're already there. So, once you get your third fragment, you're going to want to double click the first frag and uh, use it on the second frag. This will give you the unfinished uh, beat of time. You want to then click on the unfinished beat of time and uh, use it on the third thought fragment. This will give you the completed crystal bead of time. Now to use this, you uh, can't be just anywhere in Five Valley. Uh, I found it works to go to Five Valley Beach and go up a little bit. Also, it sounds like a train for some reason. It was actually kind of fun. So now that you killed the, the train, uh, go straight back to Silveria and talk to Elder Slain. Give him the thought piece of time and he will give you the Cloak of Illusionist, which is actually a pretty nice item. So your time and effort was actually rewarded. So congratulations, you just completed the level 45 quest as an illusionist, and uh, keep on going to 50.